Howdy folks, Olin here. Instead of pressing on with Issue 10 story content to uh, youth outreach, I'm going to be sort of taking a sidetrack and picking up one for the Aegis, because quite frankly, um, since it's a new mechanic for the issue, I imagine Aegis shields are going to be kind of important. So I, I understand that you get Aegis shields from this mission, so here goes nothing.救済法ってのは知ってるか。つまりだな。もしお前が何か価値のあるものの金<笑> どうやら俺は奴らのマスターブランの一部を知った。途絶えなる危険を犯してな。そこに転がってた死体からそれを救出したんだ。お前が故障薬だ。いいな。ただし、俺の取り分は7割だぞ。So like the um, little conversation bits, kind of kind of neat. The, one of the one of the bits in the bomb there uh, talks about why there's always new monsters. Apparently, the infection is outside of the quarantine area too, and they just toss infected people into the city. So, yeah, fun little tidbit. Uh, just in case you didn't know, there's also a lore like right over there. So, anyhow, find the body Jake salvaged the controller from. Can do. You know what I need to do here? I need to... not going to remember to use it as often as I should by any stretch, but the shield is nice and useful, so might as well. Okay. Come on. Oh my. These are just all over the place, aren't they? Odd cadaver, I found human remains. What's more, they look gnawed on. The bite marks look chillingly familiar. Dun dun dun. Examine the guy. Wait. Oh. Goes back over that way. 
I guess I'll pick that back up when I go back over that way. Only makes sense. Hello? Okay, here's the guy. Deal journal. Um, supplemental field journal. Three of us drew the short straw, so three of us are testing the new tech. In hell, I didn't sign up for this. Too cliche. Yada yada. I had a shield controller, highly experimental, not ready for field work. Mimic function and functionality of quantum effects recorded in research data gathered in Kaiden, supposed to blah blah blah. Um, it's testing psychic. Okay. Clean up, type out. Yeah, poor guy. So, I need to fight psychic guys. Really, even more? Oh, I'm gonna get even more and more. Well, let's just initiate. Ah, dang it. Huh. Okay. Does this have anything interesting to do here? Uh, find orders. He didn't live long enough to complete his task. What are the orders? Oh, okay. Well, this is a nice thing that pairs well with what I have to do. Destroy psychic, destroy cybernetic, destroy demonic, yada yada yada. Um... Really? Will you not stop? There we go. Um, well, I'm full on these side missions. I probably should have completed, what was it, Death and Noodles when I was up that way. But what can you do? Hindsight and all. I'm going to have to kill more of those on the way, so... Anything... Uh... Come on. Head it down that way. Might as well kill more guys on the way. I mean, they don't... Bloody hell. <sighs> Seems like it activates kind of quickly. Maybe that's just me, though. Um, these guys look ripe for taking down a large group. There we go. All right, to the train yards. Now... Let's try going down this way. Really? hate those guys so much. Which is, you know, a running theme that you might have uh, heard me used before, but you know, 
It's no less true this time than it was last 500 times. I suppose I could just run past folks, but... But really, where's the fun in that? Anything down here? Maybe. Oh, no, I can't even go down that way. Got a bit of a high jump, haven't I? Yeah, switch over to cybernetic then. Even more? Good lord. They really packed this place full of uh, side quests, didn't they? Not that I'm complaining, mind you. They do make... Uh, they do kind of make the world feel a little bit more... Like, lived in, I guess? Isn't exactly the right term, but... Kind of what I mean. Is this inside the train, maybe? Ah. Smiley mech. Why did I just get one of them and not both of them? Can I complain, mind you, but still. Alright, now after I com after I went and defeated ten, I assume I have to fight five more of these guys. Might as well fight little minions, right? What? Ow. What? Oh, it has a shield. Like a really good shield. That's not fair. That doesn't seem like it would be good. Cybernetic 
Galactic Energy data collected. Collating. Please stand by. Huh. Okay, so it said 20%, but it really took all of them. That's at least something, I guess. Hello, giant mech. I don't really want to fight you if I don't have to. Wait, what? Yeah, bloody hell. A sky drone, eh? Man. These guys are much sturdier than they were in the past. You are not authorized. You are not authorized. Someone attacking me? No? Okay, good. You will come back, or we shall be forced to cancel your life. Right. Um, way to be, way to be creepy, guys. Where am I going? Ah! Oh, you again. Well, I know you're useless until you... at this point. Ooh! What? Hmm. I'm not sure exactly on like when I'm supposed to be and when I'm not supposed to be hurting its shields. So there's plenty of times I would have thought I would be hurting them, but you know, zero points of uh, damage done. And other times when oh no, not spores. Bloody hate these fungal things. They are so freaking annoying. Um, I really seriously hate those guys so much. Are you maybe up upstairs? I hope so. You are not up here, but I mean, I guess I might as well fight you. Not that bad. Um, so over this way is... Hello! That looks actually really cool. It, it really, really does. Um, curses. I was hoping to... You know. Jump down on the other side, yada yada. Uh, might be able to do that from this one, though. Let's see if there's any luck whatsoever. <sighs> wow, yet more of these. There are a ton of these missions over here. Look at that. All those little. couple over here, too. Nice. Um. Yeah, this may not go well, but let's give it a shot. Um. Oh. Yeah. Okay, not the worst. There are easily things that could have been much worse than that. So, cool. Let's 
see if I can... Nah, I fail. Alright, well... Ooh, lore up there. Um, first, however, I really want to find these... Find the guy I'm obviously supposed to find. So much hate. No, that is not a way in. Okay. Um. So I guess was I right? And do I have to climb up and then jump down? Is that the easiest way to do this? Do I have to go like jump to that animal well and then? Probably the easier way to do it. Uh, however, let's try it this way first. Ha! Oh, can't get to me. Can't get to me. Neener, 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 neener. Um, you, however. Yeah. Okay. Um. Where? Are you over here then? Is that the? You're sort of down over this way. Is that the? Ooh. Hey. Someone's alive. Where are you? Where's the bloody freaking controller? I'm supposed to... You can have anything you want. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> so now... Fight demonic guys. I can do that too. I'd actually prefer to do more of that because, you know... I kill their shields faster. Yeesh, all right. That wasn't bad, all things considered. So can I get this lore from down here? Ah, curses. Alright, so... Send this... Oh, I finished cleaning house. So, gotta follow after insane running guy. What? No. Cutscene. Okay. That sounds pleasant. <clears throat> you damn dirty ape. Ha! <laughs> Fantastic! Oh. Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> I... I... I mean, I'm not surprised. Uh, the um, the writer is a giant nerd, which uh, which I I fully approve of, um, and he does put these little references in in ways that uh, I don't find immersion breaking, because you know, a filth infected ape, damn dirty ape, yeah, yeah. Also, if you don't know what I'm talking about, um. Go go watch uh, go watch Planet of the Apes. Just you you should probably watch Planet of the Apes just in general. It's kind of fantastically 
corny and cheesy and great uh, all at once. Okay. like a fun tantrum. Come on. There we go. All right. Um, one for the Aegis complete. What did I get? So... Where did this simian monstrosity come from? I see no reports of anything else like it in Kaidan. Something from the docks? Something from a wayward ship? Far too many question marks. Alright, so I have one of each of the Aegises. Um, not sure how these work exactly. Can I just... Oh, oh. So, you can only equip one at a time. That is... That is a little bit painful. Um, so... New bag. So, let me just... Make my own little bag of Age of, Age of Shield stuff. And close, close, close. Close all my stuff. Um, components, augments. There we go. Um, and I got a corrupted biohazard container, so might as well work on. Does this make sense? Okay, so if I understand correctly, uh, I now have some bit of shield, and so enemies that do Demonic Aegis damage will do part of that damage to the shield and part of the damage to my health. So, which is, which is interesting, I suppose. Um, now, that done. Um, might as well... No, nope, no, nope. wrong way. What can I get over there? Oh well, I'll Oop. deal with it later. Um, for now, however... Yeah, let's see how this works, so... Okay, it seems like that's how it works, so it's... It seems like part of the damage goes to the machine, part of the damage goes to me. I'm still taking, you know, a decent chunk of damage, but it's not quite as painful as it was before, I suppose. Um, unfortunately, this, uh, this whole thing, the, the shields only work 
on this southern part of Tokyo. Uh, it's kind of a shame, but not a whole lot that can be done, I guess. Or at least not at this stage in the game, anyway. I can, however, see myself pretty regularly forgetting to switch my uh, switch my shield controllers. That that'll probably get a little uh, a little old. I wonder if there's a um, there's an add-on for um, huh. There's an add-on the game has to automatically switch your Aegis controllers to whatever you have targeted. I wonder if that's been updated to include your Aegis shields or not. If it has been updated to include shields, um, that person is fantastic. I don't know that I really need one for... Um, I don't know that I really need one exactly for the... Uh, for my weapons, but it would be... It would be more than a little handy for for shields. Because, yeah, this probably will get old a little quickly. Anywho, so... Let us follow the trail of... Stuff. Wonder. So, no, it doesn't. I was kind of hoping that, um, like with higher levels of the shield, you would do more damage to the shield before doing damage to your health, but it doesn't look like that's the case. Okay, so, are these. Body parts. Okay. Still going this way, right? It looks like so. Yeah. Yeah, I'm probably probably going the wrong way. <sighs> Sigh. Trail of blood and body parts. Okay, yeah, no, it is. It is the right way. Do I have to inspect anything on him first? No. Okay. So, blood is going this way. There's blood and stuff up here. Looks like it's there. Right? A little bit. A little bit, a little bit. Still bloody hurts, even with a shield. Um, no? Okay. Like, it kind of looks like it's coming from this guy? From this... There we go. That the bloody... Okay. You're big. Alright. That 
that's cool. You know, I kind of wish, like, since they have so many of these little little side missions out here, that they have more kind of specific field report uh, turn-ins. Like they, they, they've, there's always been a mix of um, of these generic ones and kind of more specific stuff. But I think there's only, um, in issue 10, I think there's only like three or four story missions and the one repeatable combat mission. And the rest of it is like all these ton and t uh, ton of ton of uh, side, side missions. So it'd be nice if there would be like more specific additional quest turn-in sort of stuff. Uh, that's just my general thoughts anyway. Um, you know, it's it's not much, but it, it helps. Um, so, before I finish up, I'm going to do this Death and Noodles quest. Because, uh, why not? see supplies. I assume that's over over the fence here. Now. Where you came from, I'm not completely sure. But I can take care of you, I think. Mostly. There we go. Well, there definitely is a difficulty spike from issue 9 to issue 10 area. Not complaining, actually. It is nice to see. Especially given the current, uh, everyone was complaining about the, um, everyone was cl complaining about the, um, the enhanced player experience making things too easy for, you know, those, those filthy casuals. Okay, that's not the language they use, but it was kind of the sentiment, actually. It wasn't like a ton of people, um, but there there were definitely sort of those outspoken few who were making the uh, the community feel a little bit more uh, exclusionistic than it really has been in the past, um, and really is just you know more than it is in general. So, where am I going? Oh, all the way to Susanoo's diner. All right. Um, in that case, I am going to settings, make sure my radio music audio is turned way down, and Anima leap my way over there. I, I do, I, I love Anima leap, I do. But I, I kind of miss the, the old way of fast travel, which was just kill yourself and resurrect at a, whatever anima well you wanted. It was it was fantastic uh, and chuckle-worthy every bloody time. Seriously. And, you know, you can actually do it free of charge um, if you remember to unequip all of your equi uh, items before you before you killed yourself. Although I gotta say, the whole like suicide thing, given that um, there's a couple couple quests where you actually have to die in order to um, in order to progress along the quest, it, it it kind of I don't know I was never a huge fan of it. Um, you'd think you know because you you get um, when you have an attack that like one hit kills you, you tend not to take any item damage. 
So it would be nice if they had done it with the whole, like, you know, reset, which was the kill yourself command, um, if I'm remembering correctly. Yeah, no, another generic turn in. All right, um, might as well get, ooh. Oh, right, so you... issue 10 also has these containers that, um, they can open for special stuff. You need these keys for them, which is kind of a weird way of doing, like it's, it's like they're kind of pseudo doing a lockbox kind of deal. I mean, I, I guess some people consider the um, the mystery boxes and the deep mystery boxes from the Atom Store uh, like a lockbox, but I, I've never really considered it because, you know, for, for, for me, lockboxes are those things that contain great items that that's the only really way to, uh, <clears throat> that's really the only way to get them and you you the boxes drop in game and you have to buy something from the cash shop to open the box uh, for me that's that's what I consider a lock box and the deep mystery box is all stuff that you can get in the game and it's stuff that you know you you don't have to interact with it or get it at all um, this one you get the keys in the game and there's no like money transaction i think you need to go um go open the boxes they're here down by the docks if i'm under if i understand correctly from just vague comments that i've seen on the uh on the forums anywho um that all extraneous stuff being said that was um that was the mission and i'm going to head out for the day and until next time folks later <laughs>